Good evening, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, it's the world away. And yeah, I know, two X-Wing videos a day, you know what, it's the only way I'm going to be able to get caught up with this. So, uh, we have got issue 21 of Diagostini's Build Your Own X-Wing. As I said, I've got about seven under there, something like that to catch up with. And we've got the Terminator coming out tomorrow. We're probably going to be having the Spitfire coming out Thursday. Um, and everyone started to get payments for the Ecto-1. I want to do the victory. <laughs> There's so much I'm getting swamped under. So that's why you've got two videos today. And in this one, you've seen it before. We're going to be doing the lower wing. So, or the lower port wing, should I say. Uh, let's just show you what we're going to be doing. These are the parts here. I've already taken them out the bag. Uh, and once again, we don't need a screwdriver. It's all going to be slotting things. Uh, and we're going to be putting details on. And these little bits here, which are the only things that we're really going to see through the hatches. That's if there is a hatch on the lower port wing. I'm not sure if there is, but we'll find out. Uh, again, a lot of details that we hide there. And uh, in the next issue, once again, we're still going to be working on this lower port wing. So it's not really any different to what we've done before. I figure this is going to be a quick video. Uh, just in case uh, my printer's taken your attention away, I'm still printing parts of the uh, Vincent 3D. If you have a look at this one, this print has now fouled about four or five times because the supports keep falling down. Uh, so now I've propped them up with blue tack and they seem to be working fine. And I have done that before. So it's a, a tip for you that if your support falls down, pause the print, put a load of blue tack around it and it should print fine after that. Uh, but once the front and the back panel is done, then I can start attaching things to it. But that's going to take about one and a half days to print. But I can't wait to get a uh, Vincent build video out for you. As a matter of fact, I've just been looking at this magazine. I don't normally look through the magazines, but check this out regarding the Kenan figures and the yellowing of the ages of when it comes and how it's going to look. Uh, but I used to have one of these. I absolutely loved my Kenner X-Wing. Absolutely brilliant. I wish I still had it to... Uh, show you but i'm sure a lot of you out there have still got your kenners so all good anyway without further ado let's get cracking so the first thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be putting this bit of trim down the wing here the wing's looking this way around so it's the actual uh, diagonal side we're putting this on and the uh, large section here that we've got is going to go towards this side of the wing so i'm just going to put that in and what they recommend is using the base of a screwdriver to just push these in so let's see if their advice is good. Oh, that's got in really good. So yep, their advice is very good. And there you go, when that's in, should look just like that. Then we've got this small detail here, just to put into the end of the wing, so that the semicircular area there is pointing to the main bulk of the wing. So we just push that into place, just like that. <laughs> You know what, you get all the way to the end of your videos and then you have to go back and you have to put this section in because I made a mistake. You will see there's some continuity errors here. Uh, but basically we've got this section which has got to go in. It's like a little grey square. It's basically going to go into this section here. So I'll put that in now and I'll explain why I've made a mistake once I've got it in. Hang on, I'm just going to revolve it round and then push that in just like that. Uh, I actually put it in this red section here. As you can see, I'm meant to be putting a red square in there. Unfortunately, once again, it wasn't delivered to me. And I'm just, thank God that I do open these things on the camera because I'd be ripping my hair out thinking that uh, I've dropped this on the floor or something. But this definitely wasn't in the bag. So what I'm going to have to do is uh, probably fill that hole uh, and then, I don't know, paint it red or something or put some battle damage on it. I don't know, but uh, I'm missing a piece here is not really noticeable to be honest with you but to say that's the second thing missing in two deliveries doesn't bode well does it then we've got another detail just to put into this section here and we need to follow the colors so obviously that red's going to complete the red on that side there just push that in and that's looking just like that don't remember doing that on the first one perhaps we did but i don't remember it <laughs> then we've got this detail here which is just going to be going into the same section here very easy to do these are but uh i can see this being monotonous it's monotonous after the second time so uh the third <laughs> third and fourth times are probably going to be pulling my hair out and that's in just like that and then the last things we've got just into these two holes here we've got the discs that we had last time now these discs do go in a certain way because they have got different cutouts on each one so the first one we need is the one with the smaller cut out here and that's going to be going onto this hole here just the middle one so i'm just making sure this is lined up 
and we want to put it on so that the uh, cutouts are actually oops, just covering the bar in the middle just like that and as you can see they're covering that bar just in the middle there and then the last one exactly the same thing just on this side here so I'll get that in push that in and there we go that's the last one and as you can see the little notches there are just allowing it to go in that section and fit flat and that's all there is to do that's the wing completed from this issue now obviously in the next issue we're going to be putting a lot of framing into that wing and then starting to put the wires round ready to attach the cannon to it. But uh, that will definitely be coming probably the end of the week now. As I said we've got a Terminator video tomorrow. So I really do hope you liked that video. If you did please remember to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already please remember to subscribe. Take care.